What's up guys, Grim here. Looks like we can go 61 Paragon because we've got four healers. And whenever I have four healers, that means that I have permission to kill everybody. So, I've been getting in a lot of war fronts where the other team has a ton of healers. And we've got one healer. So, you know, with all the extra healing that's going on, you would think I'd get lucky enough to get some of those heals, but that's not the case. Hopefully we can uh, win this one. Oh, look at this. Prime Pickens. Set it up, set it up. Sonic, boom! Look at that. <laughs> oh, 61 Paragon, guys. Uh-oh, look at this guy. He's looking like he wants to be hurt. Oh, there he is. Thought he ran away for a moment there. But no, he stayed to die. What? Another one? You see me at half-life and you think you're going to kill me? Not so. Uh-oh, 2v2, look at this. How unfortunate, sir, how unfortunate. Uh, now we just got a little bit of a gank squad. Now we got three people taking on this one guy. Poor sap. Let's try to... Is that, yeah, that person got the stone before I did. That means that gives me permission to go kill some more people. Rather than running stones. This guy looks like prime pickings. Set it up, set it up. Bam! Look at that damage. <laughs> oh man, this paragon burst. And what's up with that guy, man? See... I'm getting in... Uh oh, this healer. Watch this, watch this. This healer stands no chance. Look at that. Stands no chance against me. I I almost one-shot healers a lot of times. You know, as soon as I hit my burst macro, bam, you just see a column of damage go up. And they instantly die. But what I was about to say is, what's up with all the freaking tanks in Warfronts? You got a bunch of people running around with shields, not killing anybody, just trying to be annoying. And there's a bunch of healers and a bunch of tanks. That is not PvP, sirs. That is not PvP. You are not killing anybody and nobody is going to be hitting you, so you are worthless. You're the last target on anybody's list. Go out there and be productive and help your team by actually putting some players in the graveyard and stuff. Yeah, you can help your team if you sit at a flag and just, uh, just do, uh, nah, we're not going to help him. That Dom has got that guy on check. But you're not helping your team at all just standing at a flag and, you know, hitting people as they come up and... Knowing they're not going to bother to even kill you. That stuff is for PvE ears. PvE ears. Oh, I'm going to die here. Dang it. There was three people, so. Yeah, I can't 3v1 people with this spec. This is a. Uh, a bit of a squishy spec. It's made to blow people up. It's made to uh, destroy healers. And yeah, it's not meant to uh, take on three people at once. It's not a tanky spec. Uh, with my uh, Warlord Paladin spec, yeah. Three on one all day, me bro. It, I love it. Because there are so many times I'm out doing my dailies and stuff and like two or three rogues will pop out and try to kill me and I annihilate all three of them. It's awesome. But this isn't the spec that's going to do that. This is the spec that's going to run back to the back of the, the enemy line, one shot the healer and hope I get away. Oh, uh oh, look at this. This is the example here. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Look at this. Look at this. Set it up. Set it up. Bam! Look at that! <laughs> oh, prime example, people. 
61 Paragon, right in the middle of his team, man. Look at him. He's not even... Oh, he finally respawned. He was probably thinking, what the hell, man? Who is this grim guy? Well, I've transmogged my armor, so remember it. If you see me get on you, it's done. CC, do something. Oh, that couldn't have been a better example right then. That was perfect. Right in the middle of his team, I just w basically just blew up that healer right off the bat. That was hilarious. Oh, man, what is it? Okay, now we're finally starting to get things turned around. Two of our guys have got stones, so they're probably running them in. Oh, man, just more people coming in, but if they keep coming in one at a time, I'm just going to murder them one at a time. Anybody else? Anybody else? I got some more. Let's go up here and get this buff. I like this buff. Anybody else? Uh, oh, one of the stones was returned. Let's go ahead, or brought in or something while I was up there. Let's go ahead and try to run this back. I'm not much of a stone runner spec. I'm not real tanky, so this could be very bad. But then again, if they come at me one-on-one, -on -one, yeah. You're going to get to witness me blowing some people up. <laughs> And right now, actually, my DPS is a little bit less because uh, I'm not really seeing my team healers. So I made sure to uh, have my recovery posture and uh, my uh, way of the sun on as two of my buffs. That way, every time I hit, I can heal some. Now, it, those buffs by themselves aren't really all that good. But once you stack both of them, they're pretty dang good. And they'll help you out quite a bit if you do not have a healer. They're not going to save you if you get lynched, but, you know. Man, it looks like we're about to win this. What are we at? 11 and 1 right now? Not bad. That was 11 quick kills since I came into this late. Pretty fun match, though. As long as I'm allowed to tee off on people, they're going to die. Well, that's that. 11 and 1. Look at that. Very nice. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And this is some Warrior 61 Paragon PvP. As usual, my name is Grim. And I'll see you next time.